Hello everyone. Today let's see what's the problem with this Acer projector that is it is showing all white dots. As my assumption the problem is with the DMD chip. There is L C D chip inside. So I think the polarizer of the L C D the film on that L C D has got dots. So let's see, open and check whether this is due to any dust or something on the lenses or the chip itself. Let's check and open it now. First of all, we will turn it off. Then allow it to cool. Later on, we will open it. For removing the top, we need to remove only these two screws. No need to remove the lamp as well. We need a star head screwdriver for that. If it has not been attempted at opening earlier and the screws has not been changed. Okay, after taking out these screws, just there are some locks. Don't open it when it is hot. Okay. Keep the power side. Now, here you can see lock here and here. Just try to push it back. Remove the screw. For that, first we will remove all the shielding here. Shield aside, take out the screw here. sensor now remove the PCB first of all we will check with the DMD chip whether it has pause on it if it has pause on it then we need to replace the DMD chip itself
remove all this connector if you have any confusion and if your model is different one then take a snapshot before removing the connectors so that it, you won't get confused as you can see here these two connectors are same we can I can fix it here as well as here so take a snapshot before removing the any of the connectors cables here to remove this power cable here just press the locks on both the sides here show it to you here we need to press these both locks here this way and then pull it up Keep the PCB aside. <coughs> now, for removing the lens, that is assembly. And here one. Four screws. This is the assembly. Here you can see this is the DMD chip. We will remove it and show it to you. This is the rainbow disk. Heatsink with the pad, heatsink pad. Here comes. This is the DMD chip and the DMD chip socket here. <coughs> DMD chip. This is nothing but you can say that it's an LCD or we can say it's a reverse of CCD of any digital camera or handy cam. CC digital camera it takes lights and convert it into electronic pulses or digital pulse. This one does the reverse. You take eleven pulse and generates a picture here. Here you can see the problem is with this particular DMD chip itself because we can see these spots, white spots on these. Here you can see. Here you can see these spots, white dots. These are the one which are being projected on the screen and which we see them as white spots so we need to replace the DMD chip and there is no other problem with the lenses here inside mirrors and lens if we had any problem and if the DMD chip is fine your the DMD chip in your projector is fine there are no dots on the chip itself then we can disassemble this whole assembly and clean all the lens one by one and replace them if needed so for replacing this DMD chip, you just unscrew it here anti-clockwise, take out, this is the chip, we get it on many of the online websites, so online shopping you can purchase from there. So now I can't replace it because I need approval from the client, if the client approves then I will order online and paste the link below in the description, meanwhile let me assembly it back I'll show it to you so as you can see here there is a groove notch here here this one this will fit there this way just lock it place it on the heat sink this way 
it doesn't fit in the opposite direction because here you can see there are two locks here notches and grooves here so these notches should fit in the grooves as they are one is round and one is in an egg shape and a whole shape okay, it should fit exactly here fix the both the screws on either side If you are replacing with the new CCD, the new DMD chip, then better you change the heatsink pad as well <coughs> because this might have caused due to heat dissipation also overheating. We now will fix it back. Uh, screw with the visors or the gasket you can see extra wide head and uh, spacing here is for fixing this on the lens <coughs> take the main PCB or the logic board connect the here by disconnect by just pressing it see that 
these two notches which you can see should match the socket Here uh, in the bottom, this is connected for DMD chip. So press it here once. See that no wires touches the rainbow disk. This is the one which mixes color and this connector the blue part should come on the top and the connecting terminal should be on the connecting pad should be on the bottom this way okay, if you have any doubts just Check it once before shave, putting the shave, or else you can pack it. And if you remove the lamp, then first of all fix the lamp, then power it on, or else it doesn't switch on. Okay, take the shading. Pass on all the screws here as shown. After assembling back, we will turn it on check now, power is connected, so light close, press the blue light means powering on. You can see the light coming out from the projector. The 
this bridge is working lamp is working hope this video has help was useful for you and help you if this video has help was helpful for you kindly hit the like icon share the video and subscribe to our channel if you are not yet subscribed thank you for watching everyone have a good time